up guys, RTV back, and today I got a cage setup for you guys, because I just got this guy at the Sacramento Reptile Show I just went to, that was like, last week I got it, and I just want to do a little bit of setup video in case you guys ever want to get one of these, and it's called the uh, Euro Masters Lizard, I believe, I just call him Euros because I kind of butcher that name, and just so you can see already, he is very, oh, you might eat that seed, never mind, they love to move around a lot. And I had this cage just sitting here because I had a bearded dragon and it passed away like like four months ago or something. It's just been sitting in my room. And so I saw one of these guys at the reptile show and the guy told me they're just like bearded dragons. Just they need the cage a lot hotter and they don't eat bugs, which is the best thing. They eat like any type of green really and also kind of bird seed mix. He's really crazy right now. I'm going to show you guys the bird seed. It's, kind of, it's like, kind of like bird seeds. But they're not, because like they don't have the shells. But that's the stuff, if you guys ever get one, you can see what they eat. They also give you um, the calcium on the greens. And they also eat any kind of fruit and stuff too. And the lights I use, I use a ceramic light. That's just for the winter when it gets hotter, or colder I mean. Because I just need it really hot in here. Also you got the, the strip bulb, and also the... What is that again? It's like 150 and 100 watt. Because he likes it at 120 right there. But right now it's like 115. That's basically the same thing almost. And also on that side it is... Mm, check. If he's going to check for us. He's like a freaking monkey right now. It is... 89. He has a lot of energy right now. Because he's been basking all day really. Come here. Oh. They are a little bit more skittish than a bearded dragon. I think that's just kind of like their personality. But they won't bite at all. They're kind of like turtles. Like a mix between a turtle and a lizard. And you see their face. Because they don't have teeth, I don't believe. I think they have just some like... I don't know what it is, but... Yeah, they kind of remind me of like... They remind me of a turtle. But that's just my kind of preference. But he just shed, so he has some really nice colors right now on him. Like a yellow, black, and white, and they're really cool. His name is Thornberry. You guys can get the reference. It's like Nigel Thornberry off Rugrats. If you guys get that, but thing because his tail, like this tail, is insane. I think that's like the best part about him. And he's just awesome. But yeah, I think he's like maybe a year old. I'm not too sure, but yeah, that's how big he is. He's reference to my hand, not too big. I think they get like a little bit smaller than a bearded dragon when they're full grown. Also know there's an Egyptian version of them or something that they get huge, like three feet I think. But yeah, I didn't want that one. I think this is like the Mali one maybe, it's something like that. I just know they're like from the same region. So yeah, this is a cage. He likes to climb a lot, so have like stuff high up, stuff like that. Like he can go up here and everything, like you saw, and everything like that. And also he has a little hide down there. Goes to sleep under there. And also for the vegetables, just kale and stuff like that. Because they don't need water. Like, they won't drink out of a bowl. Because in the desert, it's like, there's no water. So they get really all their water from that. And there's the seeds he eats. He kind of spreads them around, eats them there. He just kind of eats them all around. Oh well, yeah, that's that guy right there. Get him. Oh. Come here. There we go. Let's see, yeah, they are pretty tame. They just, he doesn't like being held too much. You guys give you a look of him. And I think the coolest thing is that tail. That tail is insane. That's him though. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. He's looking at the camera. Put him, I'll put him over here. Yeah, that's him for you guys. So, you guys are ever looking into getting one of these guys? Just the basics really quick. Substrate, that's livestock, food. It's basically the same food in there. You can get them in like big bags at your like livestock place, wherever they sell that. Over here is about 120. Over here, high 80s. And that's about it. If it's below 120, it's fine. Just keep it at like 110. And so if you guys are ever getting anything about getting one of these guys, they are awesome. Give you guys one more look at them. Awesome colors. I love the colors on them. And so I hope you guys like the video, leave a like, subscribe, and have an awesome day.